whilst taking a leisurely walk through the horde, I found this. It's time to scrap a Volvo headlight. Now I took this one off, as you can see, it's got a big crack in it. And as you know, unfortunately the Volvo is no longer with us. But, I spy light bulbs. So maybe one in there, well the Definitely one in there, maybe one in there. Don't think there's one in there, so I think I took that out, but you never know. Let's see what we can get off. It's definitely a motor, because if you remember. <laughs> so, because I basically, we're having a bit of a clean. That's why we're having a mega, mega video day, I think. So, goes into the Huggies box and goes into the bin. So, let's get this broken down and see what we can get. Even the woods for free. Woohoo! Right, hold on. This side bit always helps you if you turn the camera on, eh? You just see how oh, you can. So you can, yeah. Now you see there. Press down on this tab. It will go under this bar, and the whole thing shall pop off the left. Let's see what we can do with the old uh, Cameroonie on there. Oh, stick a screwdriver in the top to be able to do this one-handedly. There you go. So, just push in and go. Yeah. Let's have a little look. So this would be how you replace these inner lights. So, down with your thumb, across, pops up, turn it off. And it should just be able to to the centre part, pull the centre part out. And there's your bulb. And this one's a good one. There it goes to a connector there. Never touch the bulb if you replace them, but we don't care in this. So we'll pull that out. We've got ourselves a spare bulb. We don't know whether I'll ever use them, but I always keep the spares, fuses, bulbs, stuff like that. They do come in handy. I've still got Sierra parts knocking around. So pull that one as well. So, same as before. Down with your finger, across. Whee! Off he flies. These aren't aluminium or anything, they're just. Uh, Base metal, I've magnet tested them, so I'm just leaving them in. I don't need it. You might want it. Don't know. There you go. Oh, look, those are the adjusters for doing your, <coughs> your height of your light. Just turns the back there. Three little cogs. Oh. There you go. This one's very long, so let me watch this actually twist. Always give that a spray. With WD 40 if you're going to sit. Your main headlight up and down. Remember, it's like this. Remember, this is the front. That's where the indicator would be. So those knobs are on the top where the bonnet would be. Okay? Anyway, let's pop this off, see what we've got. So there you go, you pop that off. There's a seal around here to keep the weather out. There you go. Cab connectors. So there isn't a, actually a bulb in there, but if you can see in there, there's plenty of wires. So we'll be having them. Let's pull these out and see what we can get. So that's the harness off. All nice wires. Here we go. Right, I'm just going to take this off. As you can see, it's seen some road use. So I'm just going to pull this off. I'm not going to bother even unscrewing them. I'm literally going to waggle that piece of metal until it snaps and trade this in as a motor and strip the copper. Strip the copper from there and there. The rest of it, sadly, is a junko. So, into the huggies, into the bin. So there you go. Quick vid on how to scrap a headlight, I suppose. Um, shame, really. Anyway, bye.